And they've got the dog searching, sniffing the vehicle right now. False hit. Yeah. We don't answer questions. I think we proved it yesterday, no? Yeah, no. Yeah, we proved it that I never answered any questions. If you still wonder why this country is going down the toilet, maybe you should listen to this. The only clear choice for democracy is Joe Biden. Because you got to ask yourself, do you really think he's going to stand in the way of your democracy? Don't we want people to stand in the way of mob rule democracy? In my opinion, the greatest test of freedom is when you discover whether freedom can be tested without negative repercussions. If public servants pass the test, then freedom is vindicated. If public servants don't pass the test, tyranny is perpetuated. Now, I know there are a lot of people who don't like Keith Brown or how he talks to border patrol agents who aren't even sitting anywhere near the border, but it shouldn't matter if you like him or not. Do you like freedom or do you want to embrace tyranny? If you have a problem with what Keith Brown says, why don't you have a problem with the way the border patrol brown shirt agents treat Americans? When state agents attempt to force compliance in violation of clearly articulated constitutional freedoms, not only did tyrannical flags go off in law enforcement ranks, there's another phenomenon that materializes. Lemming Americans come out of the woodwork to condemn the men who stand for their rights while they commend those who trample those rights. Keith says the only reason he started recording these interactions is because on April 27th, the agent at the checkpoint couldn't understand why his New Mexico registered truck didn't have a Texas registration sticker in the windshield. He says since they aren't empowered to enforce traffic laws, it shouldn't matter. All right. All right. Mind if I open the door, sir? Absolutely, I mind. Oh, I'll give one second. One second. No I'm not closing oh, yeah. it, but I'm yeah, going to roll yeah, it up perfect. because like you're being weird. Yeah, that's that thank motherfucker you, who wanted to thank get you, into my you. truck. Fuck that piece of shit. Doing well. Both of you citizens? Yep. Hi, right, good afternoon. Hello. Just the uh, two of you today? Yes, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Have I appreciate day. it. Have a safe one. Thank you. Answer questions. You actually do have to answer if you're. Here. I actually don't have to you answer any goddamn questions because I have a Fifth Amendment right not to answer any this questions. Is a federal immigration checkpoint. Yes, you do have to answer right. if you're a U.S. citizen. And we're a hundred miles away from the border. No, you're not. I have not. You're not. You're not. 
Well, I am within the United States. I have a Fifth Amendment right not to answer any fucking okay, questions well, a without clear. a fucking lawyer present. I'm invoking my Sixth Amendment right. Do whatever the fuck you got to do. This is a federal I have no court. statements to make, and I'm not answering any fucking questions. You do have to answer your I don't have to answer a goddamn yes, thing. Fifth Amendment. Yes, you do. Actually. I don't have to answer you any fucking thing. Right there. You do have to answer if you get to the I don't have to answer a goddamn yes, thing. All right, then you can park right up there. You do we don't have to, have to park right up there. Yes, We'd like to be free to go on or about this our is way. A federal immigration inspection. You do I understand that, medicine. and I have a federal Fifth Amendment right to fucking remain silent. I don't answer questions. Leave me the fuck alone. What the fuck do you want? Yes, citizen. Yes or no. I don't answer questions. Kick you fucking rocks. Right, get a fucking warrant. This is being videoed. That's fine. You can read the sign right there. I don't need to fucking read the sign. I've read the law. The I've read the law. Constitution. Yes. The United We're also States in Texas. We're also in Texas. And I don't have to fucking ID unless I'm under arrest. So kick fucking rocks, bitch. You're within 100 miles. you. All right, then park right up there. Not going to park up there. Then we can call the... Call whoever the yeah. fuck you want. You're impeding traffic right now. No, you're impeding traffic. We'd like to be free about it to go on our way. I'm now, there are a lot of videos and comments out there about how people feel sorry for this polite, professional female border patrol agent. They are absolutely fine with tyranny as long as it presents itself as polite and professional. But we all know that professional tyranny is still tyranny. And those who love freedom aren't deceived by it and won't stand for it. You're the one who is stopping us here. You You're stopping us here. Disrespect us. This is a U.S. border. You don't border. need to disrespect I, me. And I am attempting to conduct an immigration inspection under Section 287A3 of the Immigration Nationality Act. And I'm invoking my Fifth US Amendment Supreme right to remain Court silent. Off. In the United States versus Martinez Fuerte, 1976, that the U.S. Border Patrol has the authority to set up permanent or fixed checkpoints. Yes. On public highways. Yes. You ha you are allowed to set up your checkpoints. I am not required. And that these checkpoints are not a violation of the Fourth Amendment. Do you understand that? I didn't say it was a violation of the you Fourth Amendment. I'm invoking my Fifth Amendment right. Inspection to allow us to complete the immigration inspection. Complete your inspection. If you do not move your vehicle, you can be arrested under Title 18. Does that mean we're free to go? Does that mean we're free to go? For this federal crime can be up to one year. I need I need the names. I need the names and badge numbers of every agent present right here, right now. And I'll be foiling that that camera's footage. So you're not willing to move? Oh, we're absolutely willing to move. Are you gonna let us be free to go about our way? No, not yet. Okay, then we're gonna sit here. Fifth Amendment. Are you a U.S. citizen? Fifth Amendment. Are you a U.S. citizen? Who are you asking? Me or Both of y'all. I am, yes. You're a US citizen. Are you a U.S. citizen? I don't answer questions. Anybody else in the back? No. No. As a driver, are you willing to move your vehicle? As long as I am free to continue in my travel. You're not free to go no. until he answers the question, the immigration question. Fifth Amendment. Okay, so neither one. I have not crossed the U.S. border. I don't have to answer that question. I have a Fifth Amendment right, and I'm specifically invoking my Sixth Amendment right to be free from questioning without a lawyer. Sixth Amendment has been invoked. Do not ask any more questions. Sixth Amendment. Am I showing the vehicle officer? You don't have to. Company vehicle traffic. I got it. We have to do the immigration inspection. We have. We have to do it. You're welcome to fucking inspect. Right. Right. Are you a United States citizen? Is the immigration aspect? Sixth Amendment. We just need to know if you're a United States citizen. That's all Sixth we need Sixth Amendment. Do you have reason to believe that I am not a United States as as citizen? You the question, sir, if you're a United States citizen, you're free to go. Do you have reason to believe that I am not a United States citizen? Yeah, I'll do you mind stepping out? Do what you got to do. I don't care. It's a company vehicle. I know. I do whatever you got to do. Don't, don't 
Don't reach in the vehicle. That's a Fourth Amendment violation. Can you shut the vehicle off, sir? Don't f***ing put your hands on him. Don't f***ing put your hands on him. You f***ing pieces of shit. Don't f***ing put your hands on him. F***ing guns drawn. You f***ing pieces of shit. Yeah. Good afternoon, sir. You as Border Patrol, would you please move yourself in the vehicle, sir? Otherwise, you will be forcefully removed. Thank you, sir. Don't fucking touch me. Please do me a favor. I do not down. consent to any searches or seizures. Step four, sir. Put your hands in the vehicle for me. I will not. Okay, sir. You need you to comply at this moment, otherwise you'll be forced to comply. What crime am I being detained for? Martinez Fuerte, case law 428, sir, states that any vehicle at 100 nautical miles will be inspected for... Keep your goddamn hands off of my brother. What the fuck is wrong with you? I do not need to keep my hands out of my pockets. There is no law that says that I am required to keep my hands out of my fucking pockets. Let's calm down, all right? We don't want any problems. I don't want any fucking problems. Keep your goddamn hands off me. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. That's assault. It's not assault. It is assault. Any unwanted touching is assault. I do not want to be touched by you or any of your fucking officers. Why are you pointing a fucking taser at me? Do I appear to be fucking armed? You're acting aggressive. Okay. My hands in my pocket so that I'm not a threat. Take your hand out of your I don't know what's in your pocket. That's what the problem is. Keep your fucking hands off me. Why are you touching me? Why the fuck are you touching me? Why are you fucking touching me? Why are you fucking touching me? I've seen several videos where the channel owners say that Keith and his brother were arrested. Well, it turns out they weren't arrested and this is all a border patrol show of force to intimidate Americans into compliance. Here's what happened the following day. I'm not answering your questions. Good? I'm not answering your Sir, questions. Brown, I'm not answering your questions. And they've got the dog searching and sniffing the vehicle right now. That's fine. False hit. Yeah. You guys are both US citizens, right? We don't answer questions. I think we proved it yesterday, no? Yeah, no. Yeah, we proved it that I never answered any questions. All right, we need to speak to your supervisor. We're going to pull over right here. All right, we're going to pull over right here. We need to speak to your supervisor. Get off my checkpoint. Go ahead. Yeah. No, motherfucker, you got a lot to say. Fuck you. Supervisor, now. If you guys enjoy these commentary videos, maybe you'll like some of my other videos. If you want to support this channel for free, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell notification icon, give it a thumbs up, share it with everybody you know. Don't forget to subscribe to my email list through my website, highimpactflix.com. If you want to support the channel further, grab a shirt, become a channel member, but more importantly, know what your rights are and stand for your rights. 
you don't use those rights, you will lose them. I'll see you in the next video.